Hi, Mom. This is a private video I shot just for you. So I'm just going to show you how the garden looks now. Okay. Ooh, tractor. Hello. This is my basil. Just getting started. Ooh, it's hot in here. Tomatoes. Tomato. And those are in the fridge with the door propped open, of course. And those stay pretty warm in there. And then, uh, these are my newest bean starts. All coming up. All right. Okay. It's the Romanesca broccoli. Now, I had to screen in my cabbages because they were having caterpillars laid on them uh, by butterflies. But now, they're doing really good. I've started tying these up. This is what the Koreans do to encourage the interior of the cabbage to kind of blanch a little bit and get kind of sweet. I've done that and, whoa, hello. That's my chard. It's, it's doing pretty good. And that's the kale. So those are the my little raised bed daily bobs. And oh, I gotta show you my bathtub onions. It's a bathtub we haven't done anything with yet. Here's my onions. <laughs> so, then we go over here. And, uh, man, I can't believe I'm doing this without a bug hood. This is awesome. There's my other kale. And I've been munching off of this. It's really pretty. I don't know if you can see the detail. Really, really pretty. Purple Siberian kale. Then we're going to go over to the garden over here. Get a good look at that. Kind of get a panorama of it here. And I'll show you each individual thing. Hopefully I won't get killed by bugs over here. This is a little cooler. But, uh, hmm. Okay, so right here. Oh, I thought I left that bucket there. Let's pick that up. Ah. Okay, it's so right there. There and there is where I planted seed potatoes. So we're going to see what happens with that. Um, I got red ones and brown ones. And this is my bottle wall that I'm building for a raised bed. I'm not done yet. I'm drying this grass out so that I can mix it with that clay and water and make cob to put to do this. See that? Yeah. So, God. It's nice to be out here without a bug head. I can't say that enough. So there's the thing that was featured in the video. If you look inside, you're actually doing pretty good. Let's sneak in. They're happier in there. Now I don't water them very often because actually it encourages them to put their roots down a little better and really try to get water. So I'm not babying them to death with water. And tomatoes actually like this, and this one has actually made itself a little fuzzier in response. So, they're doing really good, and they smell great. Uh, down this row, that's all my Romanesca broccoli. And there's chard down at the end, but these are the broccoli plants. And, uh, yeah, and so they're doing okay, but they're not ready to crown yet. They need a little more time. Um, so then... Over here, uh, I gotta get my shadow out of the way. <laughs> That's a charred plant that I'm experimenting fertilizers on, organic fertilizers. These are my cucumbers. Now, they're kind of not happy about something. I haven't really figured out what. There's some kind of a deficiency. This yellowing, maybe you guys could tell me what's going on. But you gotta see how funny this is. <laughs> that thing's like the size of a pencil eraser. That's my first cucumber, but it is actually getting a little happier. It's starting to make more flowers. The curly cue is actually going for the yarn now. I don't know if you can see that. There's all that. Well, I gotta go because the dog is crying. I can hear from here. That's that. And then those are my beets. Those are my beets. And that's my pumpkin. And those are the rest of my cabbages. See, they're getting... Oh, wow, when did that happen? 
These are getting really big. I gotta tie these guys up soon. And my beans. These are all my beans. Bush beans and they're all doing okay. And uh, yeah, this one's crawled up quite a bit. And then lastly, Salad Tower. Salad Tower's got some some gnat activity I gotta deal with, but other than that, it's doing pretty good. And you can keep harvesting from this all the time. So, yeah, that's it. That's it, that's the garden. Alright, happy to share it with you. <laughs> Love you!